Mancini and all, but <laughs> I really don't believe that's the case. That's about it. Wear it, Tennessee. <laughs> you gotta wear it, Tennessee. What's up? Oh yeah. And I'm sure I didn't make much of an impression so you don't remember me. <laughs> I was gonna say, I think I know you. <laughs> wear it, Tennessee. It's an idea that's catching on. Wear it, Tennessee. <laughs> We're in Tennessee. Hey, man, I got it. We're in Tennessee. All right. I got one of them, too. Wear it, Tennessee. Wear it, Tennessee. You're out on the water? Wear, Wear it, Tennessee. <laughs> Hello, everybody. My name is Jason Harmon for your Tennessee's Wildcast. And we're here on Piercy Priest Lake with a celebrity fishing tournament with Donnie Mack from Hunt Fish Cook. He's gonna tell us a little bit about what's going on. Hey, Jason, big day on Percy Priest. You've got 30 teams, not just any bass teams, but this is big wild teams. Let me tell you what we got going on. You know, CMA's going on this week, right. the big festival. All right, in contention or conclusion with CMA for festival, we've got the Porter Wagner Memorial Artists and Anglers Bass Tournament right here on Priest. Now, here's the deal. You've got the top end bass pros across the country and the biggest names in country music. All out there paired up today, they gotta bring us in five fish. Weigh-in's gonna be at Bass Pro Shop this afternoon. Okay. They're gonna be out there for seven hours. There's no telling what's gonna go on out there. You've got every kind of character you can imagine. And again, it's just a blast. We just got them on the water. I can't wait. I wish I could go. When will we go? Let's go. It's a bit. <laughs> I'm Plenty ready. of water left. I know. <laughs> but now, let's see, Jimmy Houston's out there. Right. Uh, let's see. Uh, Vince Gill is out there. Vince Gill, Luke Clawson, Clawson won both Bassmasters Classic and the FLW Classic, so they put Clawson and Gill together. Okay. wonder how that worked out. <laughs> yeah. Think there ain't no politics in this game? <laughs> You've got all kinds of big, like I said, uh, got G Miss Jeannie Seeley out there. Okay. She's fishing. Yeah. We've, oh, by the way, we've got not just guy pros. We've got the big names in female professional bass fishing out there as well. Judy Wong. Well, there's all the, you know, the, the names that we all know. We all sit there go, yeah. oh. But, uh, okay, all right. And then some of those ladies will probably come in and show up them guys. Uh, the money is on the women. <laughs> I, I, I'm telling you right now, there are some absolute killer bass fishing females. All right. Well, thank you for your time. Jason, my and, pleasure. Uh, let's go. Let's you. get the boat. Let's, let's ride, man. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, folks, uh, we got a chance to go out with Tanya Tucker. <laughs> it's going to be an awesome day out here fishing uh, on Pierce Priest Lake. So, celebrity fishing tournament. It's going to be awesome. We'll bring in five fish, five big ones, right, Tanya? Well, at least. I, I mean, that, that's probably what Scott's going to get. I'm probably going to get 10 or 20, I think. Okay, yeah. 10 or 20 will work. <laughs> Once we'll he shows me how to hold my nose, I'm, I'm sure everything's going to be fine. <laughs> All right. So, let's do a little fishing here. So, I hope you got like a 200 pound test weight. Over. Get a, yeah, I guess we get a real big one. He's got one. He's got one. Uh, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Yes, that's a good one. Oh, that's a pretty one. Look at him. Oh man, look. Say ah, oh. that's a nice one. How many pounds? <laughs> he's got to be. He's got to be 15 inches long. I don't know if he'll make it or oh, not. Oh, are you serious? Let's measure him. You want measuring limit? Yeah. I thought we could get some Let's see under that box, isn't it? I don't know. He's long and skinny. He might make it. He touches the line. He's a keeper. Uh-oh. -uh. Yeah. He's in. Well, we got one in the boat, folks. Tanya won. Other guys, nothing. <laughs> right? Absolutely. Well, we don't know where those other guys are. What's really important. I mean, we're having fun. And all in the name of Porter, you know, Porter Wagner, and 
you know, Porter was such an icon to all of us, um, a hero and a friend, and back to being a hero again. And and and, uh, and of course, he loved to to fish. That was his favorite thing to do, besides I think entertain. And um, you know, it's just a, a, a great thing to uh, to be able to come out here and have fun and uh, and remember our good friend. You know, he's done a lot for country music, and, and we have a lot to thank him for. And uh, uh, I just wish he was still around to hang out with us today. <laughs> Tell me what a bad fisherman I am. <laughs> on, everybody, everybody knows Porter Wagner. And I used to watch, whoops, I used to watch that show, see how my old spec and, and Dolly and the Wagon Masters. I watched that all, uh, uh, faithfully. It was what, every Thursday night, wasn't it? Or every Saturday night? No, Dean Martin was on Thursday. Yeah, I used to watch that too. Everybody loves my body sometime. <laughs> oh my God, he was one of my very favorites singers in the world. I said I did a show with him and, and his his variety show in L.A. and I said I really want to do this one song called I Will if, with uh, Mr. Martin and. Oh, oh man. Uh uh, it's it's hung up. I gotta swim in there and get it now. <laughs> But I, sure. they go, sure, you can sing with Dean. You can sing that. He'll sing that song with you as long as you sing it in his key. Yeah. <laughs> and so I said, okay. Same thing with uh, Ernest Tubb, though. When I was in nine years old, um, he came to Wilcox, Arizona, and uh, at the VFW Hall, and my brother took me down there and said, got on his bus and said, I got a, my sister here who's nine years old. We'd like to know if you'd let her get on your show tonight, sing on your show. He said, well, bring her on up, you know? And so I went on up and I remember that bus so well. I see it now and I, you know, in the museum and I, I, get, I get chills when I get on it because it's like, like yesterday. Yeah. And I walked up and I got on the bus and sat down. He sat down with me and we talked a minute and he said, well, uh, what do you want to sing? And I said, well, I sing Harbor Valley PTA. That was really hot right then. <laughs> and. Uh, and uh, I'd like to do one with you. He said, well, what do you want to do? And I said, I'd love to sing Sweet Thing with you. And he said, well, you do you do it in the same key me and Loretta does it in? <laughs> and I wasn't going to back up. I knew it was too, too high, but I wasn't going to say no. You know? I said, well, sure. <laughs> so when we did it on the show, it was like, wow, does anybody I mean, I, come into my part? I was like singing, because she sings a lot higher than I do, oh, yeah. even at that age, you know? So, um, but I sang it, and, and at the end, he gave me a big old kiss on the cheek, and he said, give me a kiss. And so I kissed him on the cheek, and my dad said, how was it? I said, his cheek was so soft. <laughs>